Blackberry's follow-up to the key one goes keyless and it's called the Blackberry Motion. Hello, it's Jay from Gadget News and uh, today I'm going to unbox the Blackberry Motion. Uh, this is the new phone from TCL uh, licensed with Blackberry and uh, yeah instead of uh, the key ones QWERTY we've now got a full touchscreen phone uh, this is obviously due to, to feedback I quite like uh, the, the QWERTY board now I've got used to it but uh, this is for people that will you know stick with swipe text in and all their touchscreen goodness so uh, in the inner carton we've got the five and a half inch screened Blackberry Motion so the screen's uh, full HD, so that's 1928 by 1080. And uh, let's just peel this off. Very glassy. And there's a little physical home screen button there. Got a nice rounded top. Typically slab sides. Curved corners to a flat bottom and a USB-C and a headphone port. There's also a little mono speaker there. Um, on the back, this, this little bit of sticky here, it tells us it's a joint micro SD and SIM card slot. The uh, Blackberry logo there, how to pop the SIM and how to insert the SIM and SD. Here we go. And uh, peeling this back, there's a nice textured carbon fibre look. It might even be carbon fibre, who knows? Um, but it's kind of like the uh, Key One's rear, but I quite like this offset with the, the metal top and the soft touch lower portion. And um, that's just quite a nice looking phone. It, it still feels quite premium. Um, it doesn't got the heft of the, the Key One. Let's get this screen on. I've already managed to smear the screen. Obviously Android, this is 7.1. Uh, it will be getting Oreo soon. That's as close as I can get it. Um, but other specs on here. Still got the Snapdragon 625 inside. Uh, that's mated with 4 gigs of RAM. There's 32 gigs of memory, but it is SD. Um, expandable. Uh, just get through all this. Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi password. I've got to get used to not having a keyboard now. After having a keyboard for quite a while, I think it's March. I think I got the key one. Yep. Okay, it's doing things with the and yep, yeah, it's attached to the internet and now it's just doing a quick update. Um, but it's a it's a nice looking phone. You've got a, a multifunction button at the side, uh, whereas on the key one, every button on the front and the side you can assign to different shortcuts. This uh, actually knows where you are and it will adjust your shortcuts for you. So if you're at work, you can have more work oriented um, shortcuts being charged by this, this little button. I think you get a choice of three on each button press. Uh, when you're out, you can press that and you can say have your map app oh, uh, shortcutted as well as a timetable app. Uh, when you're at home, you press that and you could have, uh, let's say, Netflix or Facebook, that, that kind of malarkey. So it's still still nice, you know, you can, instead of drilling through menus, uh, and that's kind of what BlackBerry did with, with the key one, and it's, it's, it's good to see that they're doing the same with this. Um, I'm just going to pause it there, wait for this update to come through, and uh, hopefully take you through some screens. Still working through updates and using uh, Google Voice for the first time. Uh, I've got it set up so all my apps are coming over from the key one 
which I'm using as camera two. Um, so that it's all appearing. So I'm getting all kinds of um, email notifications and apps loading. But at least I can go through a little bit uh, with the, the, the phone. Uh, get rid of that. So um, yeah, I don't think I've mentioned the 12 megapixel camera at the back. Uh, it's got auto focus and it will do 4K video. Uh, at the front you've got an 8 megapixel uh, snapper for your uh, video calls and selfies. The SD card um, I did mention, but I didn't mention that you can it'll take up to a two terabyte card, so that's plenty of memory for your apps, and music, and and whatnot. Uh, what else have I not mentioned yet? Oh yeah, four thousand milliamp hour battery. So uh, the the key one I can easily get through a, a day of uh, use with. So it's going to be fun to. Uh, mess around with the BlackBerry Motion and see what uh, stamina it's got. Um, what I did mention earlier uh, is this convenience key on the side. Now if I press it in front of this camera here, you can see you can set up three profiles. So you've got a car profile, meeting profile and a home profile. Obviously, they're suggestions, but uh, so your car profile, uh, let's say your, your map app, and um, I don't know, uh, say traffic warnings or something. Uh, your meeting profile it would be note taking or um, whatever you want there. And your home profile, like I said before. It could be your social social profiles uh, or meet your favourite media, so whether it's uh, Amazon or uh, uh, Netflix or, or whatever your choice is. So uh, you can do that and just add a new shortcut. Uh, let's say open app, and I want it to open. Do I want it to open? I'll do it open to up maps. So in theory, I'll put that in my car profile. There's voice search, play music. Yeah, okay, so it's pre pre sorted in car Bluetooth. That's kind of neat. And what you've got in the meeting profile? Camera in the meeting. Yeah. Home profile, torch and a camera. Okay. Uh, people at BlackBerry kind of weird, but uh, it's useful nonetheless. So, um, yeah, the screen is nice and bright. I think it's the very rare and full brightness. Uh, there we go. Um, it's nice enough, and it flicks through everything quite nimbly. Um, I mentioned you've got the home key there, and then two. The touch buttons. Let me just get rid of them. So when when the phone's off, you've just got that sort of slab looking at you. And when you've got power on, the buttons. And this is obviously your uh, fingerprint sensor. Camera. You've got to say yes to everything. I'm not going to show you too much of the room because it's a bit of a mess. But it's kind of neat. Um, yeah, it feels nice enough and Going nipping in and out of apps. Fairly quickly. So yeah, um, review to follow. But that's the new Blackberry Motion. So uh, until next time, keep it gadgety. Mm.